Hi everybody, welcome back to this week's Tuesday Tip. Uh, we're just gonna continue on with last week's tip and talk about the path of the catch for freestyle and what everything that's happening underwater with our arms. So, uh, we left off last week talking about how we're working on that angle of entry, uh, fingertips down, getting the wrist underneath the elbow so you're able to catch with your entire forearm and your palm and your fingertips. Uh, and you wanna catch with as much surface area as you can throughout the stroke. The way you do that is that angle of entry is nice. You got the fingertips down, working on getting the wrist underneath the elbow. But if you notice, my thumb is in line with my armpit throughout the entirety of my stroke, okay? Uh, that'll help with just rotating in as we're pulling, finishing the stroke and lifting with our elbow at the end for that recovery portion, okay? A lot of the times at the end of the stroke, you flicking that wrist, that's doing nothing but moving that momentum downward when you should always try to move forward with your stroke. An alternate way you can think about it is uh, the angle of your elbow. On that entry, you're trying to get a nice long reach so you're close to 180 degrees. You can have that soft bend in the elbow. As you pull, never have your elbow past that 90 degree mark, okay? If you collapse and bring that hand towards your chest, you're pulling water that's moving with you. You're not pulling static water. You want to pull dense and deep water throughout the stroke, and the way you do that is keeping that elbow above 100 to 110 degrees, okay? Never passing that 90 degree mark. Keeping it here as you follow through, and then come back up. Thank you for watching this week's Tuesday Tip. Uh, hope you enjoyed. Give it a shot with your freestyle this week, and. Uh, until next time, have a great day.